How he copes with that, I don't know. That shows how much he loves the fair. Hello folks and welcome to today's vlog. You join us very late in the day, as you can see it's already dark. Something wonderful has happened. The fair followed us home. Are you excited? Yeah. Already filming, not filming, just texting because she's... Are you a teenager yet? Not quite, are you? Not quite. I bet Andy is filming, so expect a channel on... An, a channel? Expect a video on Andy's channel an hour after this one comes out. But the fair, a much smaller version of the fair that we were at the weekend, but a fair all the same, has come to our hometown. It's cheap night, opening night. I'm reliably informed every ride is a pound. So after ploughing through like 60 or 70 quid on rides at Nottingham Fair on Saturday, we're now going to try and redress the balance in the world and have a cheap fair trip. Are you wearing the same jumper you wore in Nottingham? I'm wearing the whole same outfit. Disgraceful. It's a little bit smaller than the other one. This is what, what you do in the sticks, I guess. <laughs> it's a big fair in the sticks. <laughs> when I was a kid, this fair was the social highlight of the year. <laughs> it really was. This is all we had. We had this fair and then we had bonfire night in like three weeks. The other, the other 11 months of the year, there was nothing for us here. Good? He's got a bell on there. That's him sorted now. A bell and a train combined. They don't seem to have any mushy peas. No, that's because it's normal round here. Roast pork, sweets, chips, sweets, no mushy peas, because round here we're normal. If you don't know what I'm talking about, you should watch our Goose Fair vlog from the other day. Is that good, Andy? What are you going on then? Are you going on that? Maybe. 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 You'll take that with you. Boo. You go on it. I can't go on it. It'll have a weight limit. How does he get in these rides? Backwards. It's like something out of a cartoon. <laughs> Thought you were trying to get on with him. No, I can't sort of <laughs> They're definitely getting their money's worth in here tonight. Every ride's a pound, and because there's hardly any people here, and none of the rides are full. Well, none of the rides are full. Well, I guess this one always is. But they're running for ages as well. Definitely good value for money. Yeah, 
show the crowd, please, your strong to come. Here we come. How he copes with that, I don't know. That shows how much he loves the fair. I think while he's on there, he's spotted the fun house thing that's there. We know he likes a fun house. You got another one then, Andy? For your own safety, please go very slowly and go one way only. He's trying to go back round. I think Anna's just giving him his camera. For your own safety, please go very slowly and go one way only. So she's had to go in and pull him out. He's been in there ages. Did you like that one? What happened there? It didn't go down the side and it wasn't the truth. Oh, uh, okay. What, you didn't go down there at all? What? You didn't go down the side at all? He wanted to, but he missed it. Oh, uh, okay. So he missed the side, wanted to go on the side. I think that's pretty reasonable, actually. I think we've lost daily. We're like <laughs> two miles from home, not even that. So all of her friends are here. We keep just losing her. Luckily, it's a very small area and it's all enclosed. No, it's weird because when we were at Pleasure Beach, she wanted to be right at the front, but clearly not here. I hope I caught it on camera. I don't know if I've ever seen him laugh and smile the way he did on that spinny floor thing. Did you see the smile on his face on that spinny floor? You nearly went flying. I know. I know. Okay. Are you going on the waltz again? Are you going on the waltz yeah, again? Yeah, one up there you quite like as well. Okay, you can go on that one after Yeah. And you want two more go on the waltzes, then we're done, I think. Amy said there's something near the door or the entrance she wants to go on, which is only that massive thing in the sky or that big side. I don't know which one she needs. It's been a lot of fun. Apparently, the one Amy wanted to go on is this one. So they're first in the queue for the next go on it. And then we will be heading home because it is, it's eight o'clock, so normally Andy would be going up for his bath like 10 minutes ago. So you can tell he's getting tired, but he really wants to go on this. So who are we to say no? Do I need to keep an eye on him? No, you just haven't. Mm. I don't know. Mm. 
That was awesome. I don't know if you could tell on the footage, but Amy was kind of arm up and Andy was pushed right in as they were being pushed out to the side of the road. You ready to go home now? Yeah. You just need to wait for Amy. Amy is over there buying sweets. Anna's just seen that there's a hooker duck over there somewhere that is giving away actual goldfish as prizes. It's like we're back in the 90s again because I don't remember the last time I saw a goldfish at a fair. But they're going back to the car because Andy has had enough. I'm just waiting with Amy and then we'll be wrapping things up. What are you getting? Yeah, so I love hearts and candy floss. Yeah. This is your second bag of candy floss of the week. Yep. We're at the dentist tomorrow. Oh well. There we go then, we are done. Did you have a good time? Yeah. Awesome, so we are going to end today's vlog here because we need to then catch up with Anna and Andy. If you have enjoyed it, please make sure you leave a nice big thumbs up on there for us. Subscribe to the channel for more daily vlogs and thank you very much for watching. Cheers. Thank you.